What's going on, everybody? I am that driving guy, and my office gets me where I'm going. If this is your first time, go ahead and subscribe, hit the bell, and hit all. That way you're notified every time I drop a video. And don't forget to hit up the description box for some essentials that can help you along the way as you're out there dashing. All right. So, as the title states, DoorDash app has another update. So, this um, update has gone through a few different changes. So, I'm going to start from the beginning with them. So, when I first started, when I was in one particular zone or market and I wanted to dash in another market, I would, from the DoorDash heat map, I would click on that area that I'm trying to get to, if it's red, and DoorDash would navigate me to that area. Once I got to that area, if it were still red, I would be able to dash now and select whatever time frames were available. If it were not red by the time I got there, if it happened to turn gray by the time I got there, then I was pretty much going to have to wait until it turned red again. So it was kind of a, a gamble um, the way it initially started. It was kind of a gamble. Um, there's been plenty of times where I saw a territory that was really red. By the time I got there, it had turned gray. And then I had to sit sometimes for an hour um, before I was able to dash again in that, in that area, right? So that, that kind of sucked. So then they made an update to it and you were able to dash upon arrival. So with that one, if the area was red, you would be able to click on it and then it would say dash upon arrival and you would click on that. So DoorDash would hold your position for 30 minutes until you got to that area. Once you got to that, that new market or that new zone, you would automatically begin to dash now, right? Um, and you will be good to go. So that was a really good update because um, you had your spot held. You didn't have to worry about it turning gray on you and then you having to wait. So that one was a cool update, right? So now with this new joint, it's you're able to dash along the way. So this is how you're able to be able to um, get money on your way to a dash. So you would dash along the way and not only will they hold the position for you in that area until you got there but you would also receive orders from that area um which is really good because if you think about it if let's just say that it's maybe 10 let's say 10 to 12 miles um from where you are or where you're going from where you are right if you happen to get an order that um, comes in, it's going to more than likely be from the area that you're going to already. So from wherever you are, you're going to you're going to get paid for the distance now, right? And your drop off more than likely is going to be within that that new zone or that new area as well. So you're going to get the extra money for the distance, not to mention whether or not there's the tip included and you know other things. So that makes it even better being that um, you get to you get to dash along the way. So you don't have to wait until you get there. Um, you don't have to navigate it. So everything went in steps, but gradually DoorDash is adding uh, new things. They're tweaking things. Um, and this could possibly be something that came from uh, the, the employees having to dash possibly. You know, these are things that they tweaked up to kind of make things a little bit better for us. So that's cool. Um, I'm not sure if this is something that is in every market. Um, I'll, you know, I really would appreciate you guys hit up the comments. Let me know where you are and whether or not this update um, took effect on your app as well, um, because I'm really curious to find out 
whether or not this is something that um, hits hit everybody. Usually something like this, it does. Um, but I just want to verify. So hit up the comments. Let me know where you're from and let me know whether or not um, this hits your market as well. Well, I hope that you all found some value in that. Um, don't forget, let me know if that's if that's something that hits your markets. As always, I appreciate y'all. And until next time, I'm a holler.